Now let's hit 1A for a semifinal between the number one team in 1A, the good Hugh Wildcats. And throughout the Gopher State, they're taking on Spring Grove. Elizabeth Gadian, star, bringing the ball up, does a little hezzy fake, and between two players gets that scoop layup to fall in the lane. Early edge for the top seed. Lions clawing their way back. Kinley Soini comes up with the steal, takes it the other way herself. A little pull up from the elbow, gets the Lions going. Good Hugh, still leading though, and Kylie. Kylie Hamill, left alone for three, knocks it home. That would cut into the Lions' deficit. Spring Grove in the midst of a big run now. Siri Conkle ahead to Emerson Ingvelson, who gets the and one to get Spring Grove closer yet again. But Goodhue would continue to hold on to its lead, and its lead would only grow. Mackenzie Lodermeyer, pure from downtown there. They pull away in this one, winning it 73-49. to now let's go to the other side of the bracket. It's the 3-2 matchup where early on Hayfield and Rushford Peterson were trading baskets. Chelsea Christofferson goes to her strong hand, finishes between two defenders and one to give Hayfield an early lead. On the other end now, Taylor Helgmo with the fake goes to her left and look at this scoop layup underhand. Beautifully done from Helgmo. Nadia Happel now for Rushford Peterson, running the floor, gets the nice little pull up to go, jump stop, that's always an effective move. Now Betsy Gillette will go to her left for Hayfield and pass a beautiful dump down to Emily Hansen who finishes the easy two there. And now this two was a little tougher to finish for Natalie Beaver between three players, but gets a nice feed there and Hayfield's lead would only grow from this point. They would win and advance by 27 points. Now to no one's surprise, these two teams were top 10 in 1A all season. Now Good Hugh and Hayfield meet for a chance to go to state. This game will start at, on March 7th, that is this Thursday, tip off is 6 p.m.